Welcome back to The Breakdown with Luke. Today we're gonna to be taking a look at Anchor's MagSafe wireless charger and stand built in. This is a portable battery pack with 6,600 milliamp battery pack, 15 watts wireless charging, and more with it. We're gonna break down the pros and cons of this, let you know what you need to know about this little stand and portable charger in a quick minute. First, a few disclaimers. This was not a review unit. I did buy it myself to give you a review. Second, pricing on this changes so rapidly. I hate to give you a price and have it be wrong. I'll put a link to it in the show notes and in the first pinned comment. You can find it down below um, there on Amazon so you can find out current pricing. If I don't happen to answer one of your questions, leave me a comment. I'll do my best to answer them in the comments. And lastly, if you want to help us grow, you want to let YouTube know you enjoy what we do here, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up. We would really appreciate your support. With that said, let's take a look at it. So it's a pretty standard little MagSafe battery pack. And the idea, you just connect your phone here. It does have a built-in stand hinge here. So this also turns into kind of a clock when you're traveling. There is a USB-C here in and out, so you can char recharge it through this or charge other devices that way. Maybe you don't want to use wireless. Wireless is always a little slower than going through the standard USB. Um, now you can, for example, put this on your nightstand, have this charging, and then charge the battery pack at the same time as you wirelessly charge. This is a pass through, I guess you would call it. So as it charges the battery pack, it will charge your phone also all night. So when you leave the hotel, you can take this with you as a backup battery pack. It's charged and your phones are charged. This is the only charger you need for a wall charger and for a portable battery pack. Let's take a look at everything that came with this as we talk about some things you need to know. Now it's a 6,600 milliamp battery pack. Not exactly a standard size. Usually they're like 5,000 or 10,000. But this one should get you at least one full charge on most phones that will use this MagSafe charger. I, um, for an iPhone 15 or iPhone 15 Max, you should get about one complete charge. One to two is probably gonna be average for most phones, especially the older the phone, the smaller the charger or the battery in it, the more the charge will be. Overall, in our testing, everything worked as it should. 15 watt charging sounds like a lot, but for example, an iPhone 15, um, max will go up to almost oh, what 27, which is significantly faster than a wireless 15. USB-C charging on the new iPhones is significantly faster than the wireless charging. With that, keep that in mind. But if you just need so, uh, something for the go, it's not bad. Now it is a little thick. Now part of that's because it's got a built-in stand. Part of it's a um, 6,600 milliamp battery pack. If you're looking for something thin that maybe you can just snap onto the back of your phone and hold it there, you can keep that in mind and be able to um, keep it going. Thickness, I think for a lot of people, is going to be a big issue, but I think this is a great little device for a couple things. First of all, if I'm flying, it's a stand for my phone. As I fly, I can watch a movie and I have to hold my phone, which is pretty nice. It's also a battery pack to do that at the same time. It's also a stand next to my um, bed, maybe when I travel. I can have my phone there, have it act as my alarm clock. And when I'm done at the end of the day, I unplug it from the wall and I take this with me and now have a portable battery pack to go with me, which is a pretty nice little feature. So this is in our testing, everything worked as it should. We had no issues. The stand successfully held its position exactly where I want it without any problems. I'm gonna give this a big two thumbs up. I really did enjoy it. It was a nice battery pack and the quality of it worked well. Again though, lower your expectations about charging speed. 15 watts sounds great. Standard iPhones are 20 watts now. The 15 Max is 27. And the higher the wattage, the faster the charge, the quicker you get back out there. So this is a you know nice on the go option. So you're not tied to the wall. You can grab this and leave. Hey, you can find this on the show note, in the show notes and in the first bin comment. I'll link to it on Amazon. If you're new here, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, let YouTube know you enjoy what we do here, and we'll be back again real soon.